Philippine news today. Please subscribe and then check notification box to get all breaking news alert. Tagged by a man she needs support now. And once again a reporter from fake news CNN is whining about our president and press secretary. This time fake news CNN reporter Gemma Costa revealed on Tuesday that White House Press Secretary Sarah Huckabee Sanders had warned him not to ask President Trump any question out of topic during a bill signing event. He added that during a private conversation she had made it very clear to him that if he did his news organization would be barred from attending other bill signing events in the future. This clash came a day after he and Press Secretary Sanders had words about media accuracy during a White House press briefing. But of course, at the bill signing event on Tuesday, Acosta took it upon himself to ignore the warning and asked the president about his attack against Democrat Senator Kirsten Gillibrand earlier that morning where he suggested the New York senator would do anything for a campaign contribution. The question, which Trump oddly did not respond to took place after he signed off on the National Defense Authorization Act for the 2018 fiscal year. In his remarks about the signing, he touted the fact that his administration has accelerated the process of fully restoring America's military might in the world. It is about USA reports. After Chelsea Handler vulgar attacks Sarah Sanders, Mike Huckabee just ripped her apart. Last week, talk show host and C-list comedian Chelsea Handler insulted White House Press Secretary Sarah Huckabee Sanders for no other reason than she, apparently, does not like her dot image may contain, two people. In a sick attack, Handler commented on Sarah's appearance saying I mean, one day she has no makeup on at all. The next, she's got six foot long eyelashes, cleavage and summer whore lipstick all over her face. Can you believe what they turned her into? A proper trollop daunt. Sarah Huckabee is too dignified to even answer such a heinous insult, but her father, former Arkansas Governor Mike Huckabee, came out swinging at the insults with a few of his own. I am surprised that there were not women on the left who at least had the decency to call her out for this. I know you re probably expecting me to be very angry about this but truthfully. When I read what she said and then I watched it, I felt sorry for her. I feel sad for Chelsea Handler. She seems like a very angry and bitter person. Huckabee took the high road and it will likely infuriate Handler even more. My daughter has a husband who loves her and is wonderful to her. My daughter has three delightful children. She is a happy, balanced person. My daughter has enjoyed life. She is a pretty straight laced person. She goes to church and lives a life Chelsea Handler has never known. Image may contain two people. Then, after this heartfelt statement, Huckabee goes in for the kill shot to let Handler know not to mess with him. There is something deep inside of Chelsea Handler that says, I've missed out on a lot, I could be raising children, but I aborted them. Boom. Huckabee was right on point with this last line. These liberals need to start having morals and happiness will find them. Until then, they can continue to spout off their hate but as intelligent Americans will always be able to see through them. According to Gateway Pundit A week ago, moderator and C-list entertainer Chelsea Handler offended White House Squeeze Secretary Sarah Huckabee Sanders for no other explanation than she, evidently, dislikes her. In a debilitated assault, Handler remarked on Sarah's appearance saying I mean, one day she has no cosmetics on by any stretch of the imagination. The following, she has six foot long eyelashes, cleavage and summer prostitute lipstick everywhere all over. Would you be able to accept what they transformed her into? An appropriate drollop. Image may contain, two people. Sarah Huckabee is excessively honorable, making it impossible to considerably answer such a deplorable affront. Yet her dad, previous Arkansas Governor Mike Huckabee, emerged ready to take care of business at the abuse with his very own couple. I am amazed that there were not ladies on the left who in any event had the conventionality to get her out for this. I know you re likely anticipating that me should be exceptionally furious about this yet honestly, when I read what she said and after that I watched it, I felt frustrated about her. I feel tragic for Chelsea Handler. She appears like an extremely furious and intense individual. 
Huckabee took the more ethical route and it will probably irritate Handler considerably more. My little girl has a spouse who adores her and is great to her. My little girl has three delightful kids. She is an upbeat, adjusted individual. My little girl has delighted in life. She is a quite no-nonsense individual. She goes to chapel and carries on with an existence Chelsea Handler has never known. At that point, after this genuine explanation, Huckabee goes in for the kill shot to tell Handler not to disturb him. There is something somewhere within Chelsea Handler that says, Ivy passed up a great opportunity for a considerable measure, I could bring up youngsters, yet I prematurely ended them. Image may contain, two people. Blast! Huckabee was spot on point with this last line. These liberals need to begin having ethics and joy will discover them. Until at that point, they can keep on spouting off their despise yet as keen Americans will dependably have the capacity to see through them. It seems Sarah Huckabee Sanders is the new bad guy in the left-wing fake news media eyes. She is being savagely attacked every which way possible. From her looks to the way she talks. Scumbag has been celebrities like Chelsea Handler, who even record their sick fetishes of being a human urinal are attacking this woman. Sarah has more class in each of her fingers than these liberal hacks have in their entire bodies. Please share if you support Press Secretary Sarah Huckabee Sanders.